probably I or we or whatever, the kids are feeling a little bit more pressure than, than they should have, and people don't play well under pressure at times. Uh, but that's the way it is, you know. I mean, it, it, one more game, we know it. So can't be any more pressure than we are right now. And when I talk about leaders to step up, I'm talking about the people that have been doing it before to continue to do it, I guess is what I'm really saying, and just to make it, them aware that it's easy to be a leader in August, and sometimes, some years, it's a little bit harder to be a leader in November. But we're going to do some things different in practice, and uh, we're doing some things different off the field, and, uh, you know, uh, it's what definition of insanity is to do the same thing over and over and over and expect different results. Well, so we're going to change some things. Confidence is an issue. Obviously, confidence is an issue. We have to have our confidence back. And we should continue to keep our confidence as high as we can get it. Our health is better than it has been in recent, recent weeks, especially at the center position. I think, I think we have weapons on offense. I think we have a solid line. I think our defense is playing better. I think we're solid and explosive in special teams. You know, those are all good things. Let, let's put that all together on Saturday night. Good group of guys, you know, they've really turned their program around. They they really play very hard together, and, you know, I think they execute well. And I think if we can just um, offensively come to the game and execute what we know we, uh, you know, know how to do, then I think we should be all right. They're an odd front, meaning they have uh, three down linemen, and then they do various blitzes with their four other uh, linebackers that they have, and they play different coverages behind it. So, um, for the most part, we know what they're going to do up front, and uh, we just got to be able to you know, run the right routes with the coverages that they run when they do blitz. I think it's just overall execution. Um, you know, offensive line does good, and receivers do good, and I miss a throw, or um, everything's good to make the throw, we drop the ball, or we miss a hole when we run the ball. Um, you know, it's nothing that's too hard to fix. It's just all getting back on the same page. I don't think that we have any major problems that we need to address. It's just um, all executing the things that we need to do individually and uh, come together as a unit and do it all the same. You know, at the same pace. Really, think it's just execution. You know, we've had guys open that I've missed, and you know that's my fault. And um, also, there's you know the defense. There's a lot less time for stuff to happen. Everything happens quicker in the red zone. So, you know, we just have to adjust what we're doing. You know, um, in our routes to to get open. I got to hit those the routes when they're there. You know, the emotion is going to be there, and it's you know a long five years of playing here and our last home game here, but. Um, you can't look at it as that, you know, we got to look at it as another opportunity for our team to be successful and um, come together and try to get a win. You know, it's always one little thing that's messing up the entire, you know, play. It's like one guy does one thing wrong. It's, it's a receiver, it's an old lineman, it's a running back. So we just got to kind of practice a little better and um, focus on our assignments a little more. That's basically what's really going wrong, I think. Just gotta, if you are feeling pressure, you just got to let the release stretch, you know, let it go. Just come out and play and have fun. That's what I think right now. We got to come out here and uh, work hard out here and practice hard out here, you know, focus on our assignments and just play a game. Like, you know, play the game like it's a game. And don't, don't be so stressed out about it. Yeah, it's definitely going to be you know, emotional, but uh, I think that's going to make me play that much, that much harder, and I think it's going to make all the seniors play like that. So. SMU, they're a pretty fast team. They they do a lot of different things, but they mainly stay to their um, stay to what they're going to do. They have like a whole bunch of fast people and a big back, so offensively they, they're a pretty good team. They try to just put up a lot of yards. Like if they're running the ball pretty well, they're going to keep running it, but their main objective is to pass on us. It just motivates us. Uh, three straight losses. We still play as hard as we can. We're still trying to get this bowl victory or this bowl eligibility and the sixth victory for us. It's about going to work still. Like we're still gonna have fun and we're still gonna play confident, but it's about just going to work and doing our jobs.